Honorable Chief Guest, Padma Shri Shri Karthi Gai Sharabhai, Provost Dr. Ravi Singh, esteemed members of the governing body, members of the management board, academic council, and board of studies, the registrar, deans, and the HODs of the university, other faculty members, my dear friends, and most importantly, my newly graduating students. A very good morning to all of you. On this historical day, I welcome you all to Adani University's first ever convocation. It's a wonderful day today. It's a day that validates our chairman's vision to create a university of excellence. This is the first day for this, uh, to start this journey. And that's why it's going to be one of the most memorable days in the history of Adani University. As you all know, the move to form a university was finally approved in 2022. And this happened after relentless, enduring efforts. So I take this opportunity to congratulate the senior leadership, the faculty members, as well as the entire administrative staff who have worked relentlessly so that we could see this day today. Now let me address the stars of today. My dear graduating Adaniites, congratulations to all of you. And this is a fantastic defining moment for all of you. This is a day to celebrate your dreams, your aspirations, your beliefs, and your achievements. Education is an incalculable luminosity where everyone knows that knowledge is intangible, but the progress of humanity is dependent on its trickling effect on the, on the very last person in the society. And this is through th formal and meaningful education. Both Gautam and I believe that education in life sciences with a special focus on research and innovation will shape the new face of India. Our country is a powerful, is a powerhouse of human capital and the Adan University, in alignment with our Prime Minister's vision of Atmanirbhar Bharat, strives to harness the right talent through education. Friends, the pursuit to knowledge is never ending. And this convocation is not the end. It is a milestone celebration of the knowledge you have gathered here before you enter the professional world. So make no mistakes that the professional, in the professional world, there will be times when you will unlearn, relearn, and again excel in whatever you do. Having said that, this small aberration should not even deter your, uh, you from attaining excellence. It is the, if you need to possess knowledge, tenacity, rationality, and intelligence. With this, no, you are unstoppable. Excellence will set you apart from the competitive car, uh, crowd. It is this excellence instilled in you right from the beginning by your parents, by your teachers, and the professors in the university. We wish that you create, that you carry this excellence and become brand ambassadors for the Adani University. I talk a little bit about the corporate world. So in the corporate world, as in every aspect of our life also, change is the only constant. The world around us is changing at an unprecedented speed. Today, Young, bright individuals with zest and vigor are bursting with new ideas and much like yourselves, are extremely aspiring. You are about to enter a world where you will be working with people born in the 60s, 70s and 80s. So it's very important to learn from the people, from, from everyone with their invaluable experience and wisdom. 
and it is also equally to put forth your your ideas and thoughts for that is what will define you and your generation this will eventually harmonize in what we can say create a new atmosphere which will be in tandem with the coming days as the millennium as the millennium come till then i would say have patience learn and interpret from the world around you and i also want you to be courageous and there will be lots of uncertainties and uh, failures and which we should not be discouraged by and that failures simply help to put you on a path to greater progress ensuring that lessons are appropriately learned remember success is never immediate nor is there any shortcut to success it is a rather slow process but it requires consistency in terms of improvement in terms of learning there are sacrifices as well as failures which need to be mitigated but the courage is one thing which you never have to leave to materialize your dreams you require also unconditional effort and unprecedented obsession i am certain that each one of you have different aspirations and i urge you to keep striving to make your dreams come true my dream to see the adani university getting recognized at a global level and seeing the university achieving global rankings is today is the starting point so i am confident that this dream will become a reality with the collaborative efforts from all our stakeholders the students the faculty the staff members the leaderships as well as every associated industry partner my dear graduating students you are the most important stakeholders in the this never ending task of institutional building show the world that what you have learned apply it and spread all the word about your alma mater this will be the greatest gift you can give back to the adani university the doors of the adani university are always open to you and so please come and share your experiences your knowledge and give the learnings to your student to the new coming students we all know that knowledge which is shared is multiplied and so it is better that you multiply in your institute in your motherland and in your country you. i would like to quote a sanskrit shlok from acharya charakya vidya vitar ko vidya vitar ko vijnanam smruti tatparta kriya yasye tesh gunas tasya nasa dimati vartate nothing is incurable for anyone who possesses the six qualities of knowledge rationality science memory power readiness and functionality today at the first convocation of adani university i am proud to say that we are ready to impart all these qualities to the young minds of the of this coming years for these children you all will be the seniors and seniors who are our brand ambassadors seniors who will they look up to for inspiration as well as aspiration having absorbed the values imparted here i know that you will be humble while you climb the ladders of success i wish you all the joy contentment success peace and prosperity in your professional as well as personal lives it has been a privilege to address you and i once again extend my congratulations to all the students receiving the degree today may god bless you all thank you very much